the one who told Scott about me and Sonny. Guilty. And it was you who figured out that Willow knew something. At least so how could you? You're free, Nina. That's all that matters. At what cost? You and Scott may have wrecked Sonny and Carly's marriage. Pity. More champagne. Why aren't you two drinking yet? And destroyed my life. All the more reason you should be drinking. And I didn't destroy your life, mind shots. On the contrary, I saved it. I've allowed this club and my father's return to monopolize most of my attention when I should have been giving you my time and energy. Well, thank you. But all the time and energy that you've put into this club has been totally worth it. The Savoy is a success. <laughs> and so are you. Well, thank you. I, I didn't think I needed to hear that, but um, thank you. And listen, as far as your father goes, look, I, we'll I, I, I really don't want to talk about that, man. Not when I'm trying to have a special evening with my lady. Well, that's always nice to hear. Yeah, in fact, I would like nothing more than for us to be closer. What a coincidence. Because I want that, too. Ah, where's the champagne? Life's a ball. We got a lot of living to do here. I'm afraid Nina doesn't see it that way. Are you still upset, Nina? Yeah, I'm upset, Scott. The last thing I wanted is for Sonny's and my feelings for each other and Nixon and Falls to be used as a weapon. Well, funny, I didn't think you would want to rot in a prison in Pennsylvania. And if I blindsided Willow, I had to. We might have lost. Well, I would have taken the risk, Scott, because now Carly and Sonny, they're hurt. The whole family is devastated. Well, I didn't know the Carrizo's family morale was such a importance to you. Maybe you should have told them that Sonny was alive a year ago instead of keeping it a little secret. Okay, that's it. I can't stay here. I am so sorry, Maxie. Happy New Year. I love you. I'm mad at you, but Happy New Year, Scott. Unbelievable, Scott. You're as tactless as you are rumpled. What? What is this rumpled business? What, what did I do? You said too much. That was unnecessary. I got the charges dropped, didn't I? Even so, you didn't have to rub her nose in her mistake. Oh. Are we having a little love spat? <laughs> 